In this video, according to your request, I will discuss about one of the best trading view indicators for gold or XAUUSD pairs. First, I will teach you about how to use trading indicators which will be discussed in this video. Then, I will backtest this indicator to show you that this trading indicator has a very high win rate. But before this video starts, let's play the intro of this video. Before we discuss this video, I have interesting information for you. I often get questions about what app one use for backtesting in each of my videos. The application I use is called TraderEdge. TraderEdge offers a backtesting service that allows traders to quickly record all their trades as they backtest. The advantage of TraderEdge that I like is, backtesting with TraderEdge is three times more efficient than traditional methods like spreadsheets. In addition, for each backtest that you do, TraderEdge will give you several data that related to important metrics like profit factor, average winning and losing trades, as well as an edge score that grades the worth of your backtest. Click the link in the description below to get a 7-day free trial from TraderEdge. Now, let's start this video. You might be wondering what trading indicators we will discuss in this video. The trading indicator that we will use in this video is called Zero Lag SMA or ZLSMA. I will teach about you how to place this trading indicator on your trading chart and how to use it. In addition to using the ZLSMA indicator, I will also use the Exponential Moving Average Trading Indicator with a period of 200. The Exponential Moving Average Trading Indicator with a period of 200 has a role as a trend filter indicator. With the trend filter indicator, we will be able to increase the potential profit from the trading indicators that we use. Now, I will teach you how to place the ZLSMA indicator on your trading chart. First step, please open your trading chart. Please remember, the trading indicators that we discuss in this video are trading indicators for gold or XAUUSD pairs. After opening your gold trading chart, Please remember to change the time frame you are using to 1 hour. This is because this trading indicator works well on the 1 hour time frame. After that, click the indicator menu at the top. In the search menu, write down ZLSMA. If so, several ZLSMA indicator options will appear. Click the ZLSMA indicator created by Verifid. Then, close the search menu. At this time, your ZLSMA indicator has appeared on the screen. However, there are some setting changes that we must make. Click the settings menu on the ZLSMA indicator. Then, click the chart section on the indicator time frame menu. After that, several time frame indicator options will appear. Please choose an initiator time frame with a period of 4 hours. If so, click OK. So now, your trading chart has changed like this. The reason why I use the 4 hours time frame chart on the ZLSMA indicator is because the gold or XAUUSD pair has stable market conditions on the 4 hours and 1 day time frames. So, by taking data on a 4 hour time frame, but trading on a 1 hour time frame, you will have the opportunity to open more trading positions with a higher win rate result. You have successfully placed the ZLSMA indicator on your trading chart. Now, we will place the exponential moving average indicator with period 200 on our trading chart. First step, click the indicator menu at the top. In the search menu, Please write Moving Average Exponential. If the Moving Average Exponential option has appeared, click the Exponential Moving Average option one time. If so, please close the search menu. Now, your trading chart looks like this. We will change the period of the EMA indicator as well. We will strengthen the 200 EMA line. First, click the settings menu on the EMA indicator. After that, the inputs menu, style menu, and visibility menu will appear. For starters, click the inputs menu. 
In the length menu, change the period from 9 to 200. If so, click the style menu. Now, we will change the line thickness of the 200 EMA indicator. Click this option under EMA. In the thickness section, select the thickness of the third line from the left. If so, your 200 EMA line will now be thicker. If so, click OK. Now your trading chart is ready to use for analysis. Now, you will learn about how to enter and exit when using this ZLSMA indicator. The use of this trading indicator is actually very easy and simple. You will make a buy entry when the green candlestick crosses from the bottom up through the ZLSMA line and the price or the ZLSMA candlestick and indicator is above the 200 period moving average line. On the other hand, you will make a sell entry when the red candlestick crosses from top to bottom through the ZLSMA line and the price or the ZLSMA candlestick and indicator is below the 200 period moving average line. To make it easier for you to understand my explanation, I will give you the examples of buy entry rules and buy exit rules as well as sell entry rules and sell exit rules. Because by using examples, you will understand how to use this indicator more easily. Now, you will learn about how to enter and exit when using this ZLSMA indicator. The use of this trading indicator is actually very easy and simple. You will make a buy entry when the green candlestick crosses from the bottom up through the ZLSMA line and the price or the ZLSMA candlestick and indicator is above the 200 period moving average line. On the other hand, you will make a sell entry when the red candlestick crosses from top to bottom through the ZLSMA line and the price or the ZLSMA candlestick and indicator is below the 200 period moving average line. To make it easier for you to understand my explanation, I will give you the examples of buy entry rules and buy exit rules as well as sell entry rules and sell exit rules. Because by using examples, you will understand how to use this indicator more easily. Now, I will discuss examples of buy entry rules and buy exit rules. As I explained earlier, the buy entry rule is very easy. You will make an entry by when. First, the price or candlestick is above the 200 EMA line. This indicates that the market is in an uptrend. Second, the ZLSMA line is above the 200 EMA line. The third, the green candlestick crossed the ZLSMA line from the bottom up. Fourth, the candlestick closes above the ZLSMA line. When these four conditions are met, then you can make an entry buy. Place a stop loss at the recent swing low. After that, place a take profit with a value 1.5 times greater than the stop loss value. Now let's see, will our trading position touch take profit? After waiting for a while, it turned out that our trading position touched take profit as we predicted. You already understand about the entry buy rule. Now, I will give an example of an entry sell rule and an exit sell rule. The entry sell rule and the exit sell rule are the opposite of the entry by rule and the exit by rule. You will make a sell entry when, first, the price or candlestick is below the 200 EMA line. This indicates that the market is in a downtrend. Second, the ZLSMA line is below the 200 EMA line. The third, the red candlestick crossed the ZLSMA line from top to bottom. Fourth, the candlestick closes below the ZLSMA line. When these four conditions are met, then you can make a sell entry. Place a stop loss at the recent swing high. After that, place a take profit with a value 1.5 times greater than the stop loss value. Now let's see. Will our trading position touch take profit?
After waiting for a while, it turned out that our trading position touched take profit as we predicted. After you understand about the entry rule and exit rule, now I will do backtesting to show the accuracy of this trading indicator. The video that you are watching right now is a time-lapse video of the backtesting I did. As you can see, at first this trading indicator had mediocre performance. While waiting for this backtesting to run, I want to convey information for you. I have a Telegram channel that shares trading signals for free. You can join my Telegram channel using the link I have placed below. Here are some screenshots of testimonials from my members who have made profits from my trading signals. Please join for free using the link below this video. It seems the performance of this trading indicator seems to be improving. Even the win rate has started to increase. Soon our backtesting will be finished. I will present some conclusions for you. Here are some conclusions about the performance of the ZLSMA indicator. First, this trading indicator has a win rate of 66%. Amazing! This is one of the best performing trading indicators, which I have tested on my YouTube channel. Second, this trading indicator can help me grow my account balance by 65% from 100 transactions. This is a very large number. This means in 100 transactions, if you use a capital of $1,000, then you will get a profit of $650. And if you place a small capital of $100, you will get a profit of $65 very good result third when doing backtesting using this trading indicator i had the most consecutive profit 10 times while the most consecutive losses that i had experienced were three consecutive losses this means that this trading indicator is a safe trading indicator this is because you will not lose your entire balance when using this trading indicator before this video ends i would like to convey a closing disclaimer Trading is a high-risk activity. This video is just a reference for you. I do not guarantee that this trading indicator will always profit and you will always profit. You still have the potential to lose all or the entire balance of your account. I am not responsible for any profit or loss you experience. Alright guys, see you in the next video.